European leaders, including French President Emmanuel Macron and European Commission President Ursula von der Leyen, are heading to China for talks with Chinese President Xi Jinping. What for? After putting a sharp edge on China over the possibility of Beijing sending military aid to Russia for the Ukraine war, and discussion on human rights and trade are also on the agenda. Our Yi Singjia reports. Both French President Emmanuel Macron and European Commission President Ursula von der Leyen arrived in China on Wednesday. Their trip is part of a three-day visit to hold talks with Chinese President Xi Jinping aimed at discussing Ukraine as well as trade and human rights issues. While experts don't expect any major outcome from the talks with Xi, the two European leaders are expected to push Beijing to limit their support for Russia's invasion of Ukraine. Others believe that the trip is just part of efforts to re-engage with China, with it being Macron's first to China since 2019 and von der Leyen's first as head of the European Union's executive arm. The trip also comes as von der Leyen expressed concerns over the EU's relations with China becoming more distant in recent years. It is clear that our relations have become more distant and more difficult in the last few years. We've seen a very deliberate hardening of China's overall strategic posture for some time. And it has now been matched by a ratcheting up of increasingly assertive actions. Meanwhile, President Macron is also expected to visit the Chinese city of Guangzhou. Macron is currently traveling with a group of over 50 CEOs, including French energy giant EDF, rail transport manufacturer Alstom, and European plane maker Airbus. Experts say Paris is trying to maintain and rebalance trade relations with Beijing. So the question remains, will the two European leaders be able to pressure China into limiting their support for Russia, while also calling for better trade relations? Lee Seung-jae, Arirang News.